Hi everyone, so today I want to talk about the asteroid that happened yesterday. So, there was a big asteroid that apparently we knew was coming called uh, Tutantis, which was 2.7 miles long and 1.5 miles wide. And it came like 4 million miles, within 4 million miles of hitting us or whatever, not of hitting us, but it went around us by like 4 million miles. Alright, that's fine. I can work with 4 million miles. But then, apparently, I learned this from watching The Daily Show, a much smaller asteroid named XE54, which is .022 miles in whatever, um, came within 140,000 miles of us and came between us and the moon. That's not okay with me. The only way that would be okay with me is if it got stuck in the orbit and then we had two moons. Because, come on, it'd be pretty cool to have two moons. We would totally feel like we're living on an alien planet. Especially, could you imagine if you went to sleep the night before and you looked up at the moon and you're like, Oh, moon, you are so beautiful. You go to sleep, you wake up the next day, and bam, two moons. Right? Assuming sometimes you can see the moon in the day, but let's say you can't. You're just living your life like, oh, you know, it's a great life. Nighttime comes, two moons. I mean, come on, you think you were going crazy. But <laughs> in any event, uh, that asteroid uh, wasn't big enough to hurt us. They said it probably wouldn't even do as much damage as the, um, the uh, Tunguska River in 1908 um, in Siberia. And the uh, bigger one... Uh, the uh, Tutanus is scheduled to come close in two years. Oh, wait, no. No, the little one scheduled to come close again two years? I don't know. This this article is not helping. Uh, I'm just going to stick with it. I don't care what happens in two years. <laughs> I really don't. Well, I do, but you know what I mean. I'm just saying, it's scary. I mean, I don't think we think about the fact that we are just on a big ball in space when anything can happen. Like, an asteroid doesn't care if the human race is here. The asteroid doesn't even care that the dinosaurs were here. And the asteroid was like, dude, whatever, and just, bam, extinct the dinosaurs. But that makes me think, maybe since we're an intelligent race of people, you know, <laughs> and we're not dinosaurs, we can start thinking about preventative measures. Someone said that if you shot enough paintballs at the asteroid, but you'd have to have like 20 years notice, and they'd have to be white, so then the sun's rays would deflect, and it would just push it far enough away to be like, don't hit Earth. Uh, so that sounds good. Or just Armageddon it, we'll send Bruce Willis whatever. I can't watch that movie because I saw a part of it when I was very young and it sticks with me. I won't tell you what part it is, but let's just say I'm afraid of just getting lost in space. Alright, that's why I'm not going to space. Because I don't want to be the person, oh, I'm hopping on the moon, hop too high, in deep space, no one can get to you, you die. That's not fun. Um, so, just makes you think, live every day to the fullest. I'm not going to say like it's your last because that's, I don't like saying that, but live every day to the fullest. You know, don't be afraid. You know, do it anyway. Huh? That's just coming up a lot in life. And by the way, what am I at? Oh, okay. By the way, uh, world's not going to end on the 21st. Mayans did not take into account leap years, leap days, leap whatevers. So, had they taken that into account, the world would have actually ended seven years ago. So, keep that in mind. Do your holiday shopping, your Christmas shopping, your Hanukkah shopping, your Kwanzaa shopping, all your shopping. Do it. I did it. Because you don't want to be that person that shows up the party and goes, oh, well, I thought the world was going to end, so I'll have your presents. Or be that person, but commit to it. All right? Be like, oh, I really thought it was going to end. I didn't get anyone presents, but party at my house. You know? Do that. But, um... <laughs> I don't know, but in any event, I will I will see you tomorrow, and I will see you on the 22nd of December, and the 23rd, and the 24th, the 25th, and the 26th, all of those days, because it's not going to end on the 21st, just like it didn't end yesterday, on 12-12-12, which, you know, I mean, if there was anyone after us to, you know, know that, that we could have documented it, it kind of would have been cool for them, but not for us gotta think about us. <laughs> but in any event, I will see you later. Bye!